Hallelujah. So Black China or Angela White recently got born again and we're gonna read this vigilant citizen article together first i just want to invite the holy spirit into this place i pray that you are touched by the love of god in this video and that the holy spirit ministers to your heart hallelujah the reason why i want to talk about this topic is because us as christians we need to be wise about how we speak about celebrities who are giving their lives to christ and how we shouldn't um, and that like a spirit of skepticism is not good discernment. When a Christian or when a celebrity becomes a Christian or they say they got born again, us as Christians, we are not supposed to be skeptical. We are not supposed to be like, oh, well, we're, we'll really see. Oh, well, but, you know, that is not how we should be receiving souls. What we need to do is we need to be praying for them earnestly, that they will continue to grow in the faith and that they won't fall away or, you know, go back into sin. OK, now a lot of these celebrities, they do take Freemason oaths and they a lot of these people are worshiping the devil. So um, uh, people will say, oh, well, you know, they're saying they're Christian as as like a deception. And um, I, I, I want us to get away from that heart posture um, when a when a celebrity uh, proclaims the name of Jesus Christ that is actually a huge step of faith. When they even say the name of Jesus, that is a huge step of faith because when these people are indoctrinated into Satanism, um, they have to sign contracts saying that they will never mention Jesus. Um, they have to sign oaths and take vows of silence and things like that. Um, and so that's why I'm so, so thankful for what Black China is doing. And she's an answer to my own personal prayers. As you guys know, I love um, praying for Hollywood and exposing how the devil is trying to deceive the people in Hollywood and celebrities. And we've been praying for a lot of celebrities here on this channel. So let's take a look at Black China's testimony together right now in Jesus name. And I just want to give a thanks to anybody who supports this ministry um, because we are able to actually read Vigilant Citizen articles together. Because, you know, you have to actually pay for this subscription. So, <laughs> so I'm so thankful for anybody who contributes to this ministry. Hallelujah. All right, let's take a look at this here. Um, so Black China says she's a born-again Christian. Her mother says she's in the Illuminati. So her mother is Tokyo Tony. And Tokyo Tony, um, we'll talk about that, okay? In the past months... Black China got baptized, removed her Baphomet tattoo, and shut down her OnlyFans account. Meanwhile, her mother says that she's actually a fake and that the Illuminati will eventually kill her. Who is telling the truth? It is rather easy to hate on Black China. That's because for years, she embodied everything that's annoying and ridiculous in Hollywood. Indeed, Black China is the archetype of the celebrity that's a celebrity for no apparent reason. After gaining some notoriety as a popular stripper in Miami, China became a household name when she went out with Rob Kardashian, which led, to me which led many to wonder if she was trying to leech off the family's wealth and popularity, which I don't believe so. Honestly, I think her and Rob actually liked each other, but um, they did not like her, and I do believe that they did witchcraft um, against their relationship and... Honestly, that made me actually so sad because I do believe they genuinely liked each other. Um, but it's okay because God is better than that. And we just pray that Jesus intercedes. These suspicions were solidified when she filed a $100 million lawsuit against the family for defamation and she lost the case. Yeah, and I, I do believe Black China was very money hungry, though. I will say that. Because my thing is, why would she date rob kardashian to leech off the family's wealth when he's not like the wealthy person in the family if she wanted to leech off of somebody's wealth then black china would be with somebody who's way more rich and black china is like very rich herself whatever meanwhile china's physical appearance kept getting weirder as her face breasts and buttocks were artificially inflated using various forms of fillers and injections then, like many other celebrities who are lacking discernible talent, she started posting pornographic material on OnlyFans. So I'm not going to show this photo because it's like she would do like foot fetish stuff and like gross stuff and she would advertise it on her Instagram and would promote people to go check out her OnlyFans. Um, and she actually became one of the top.
top um, OnlyFans earners. So in short, it was very easy to dismiss China as a vapid, untalented Hollywood harlot. However, in the past year, China basically reversed everything she mentioned above. She shut down her OnlyFans account, reversed her surgeries, removed a demonic tattoo of the Baphomet, got baptized, and became a born-again Christian. Are we witnessing the miraculous transformation of Black China, or is it all, as some claim, an attempt at rebranding herself and tapping into the lucrative Christian market? Here's a look at Black China's transformation and the hate she's been receiving from many, including her own mother. So in 2022, China got baptized on the day of her 34th birthday in March of 2023. She posted a video of the baptism on Instagram with the caption, I got baptized May 11th, 2022. I was watching the video again and wanted to show you this because if you look closely at my mouth, you can hear the spirits leaving my body. God is good. Hallelujah. Deliverance is real. And I, I do believe that there is redemption for these celebrities and they do need deliverance. And when you get that deliverance, like it empowers you so much as a Christian. And I'm honestly like, honestly, y'all, I believe her. I believe her. And I just see the Holy Spirit moving right now in Jesus name. So in the months that follow, China made some big changes in several key aspects of her life. First, she dropped the name Black China to go with her actual name, Angela White. Appropriately enough, her real name happens to sound much more angelic. Hallelujah. Through numerous Instagram videos, White documented her process of removing her facial fillers, silicone injections, and other implants she had on her body. Um, in late March 2023, um, she made a rather symbolic move and she removed the Baphomet tattoo she had on her hip. So this is actually a um, photo of the devil. So the Baphomet is a symbol of the devil. And um, we've gone over this a couple of times in our old conspiracy theory videos. Um, but we have the pentagram on the forehead, the head of a goat, because the Bible um, says that um, that Jesus is the shepherd and that all believers are the sheep of Jesus and that the goats represent people in sin, disobedient people. So that's why the goat represents sin and that's why it's the head of a goat. Um, and then you have the, the hand up and the hand down. It represents as above, so below, which represents perversion, like inverting um, what's right and what's wrong. And then you have the Baphomet also has um, breasts and also a... Um, male organs and female organs because it represents inversion um and so yeah so that's kind of why this is a symbol of the devil and the symbol that satanists use to worship the devil so she got this tattoo removed hallelujah she said in an instagram video that the tattoo had to come off as she couldn't have no mark of the beast on her she added that she did not want anything negative or demonic on her body anymore in her second post about the tattoo white wrote Thank you, God, for saving me. Removing this Baphomet tattoo, I'm sending all this energy back to the owner. Full name, Baphomet, Elias, Satan, the devil, Mahomet, Baphomarias, Sam Samael, Lilith, Goat of Mendez, Sab Sabak, Goat, Goat of Lust, Azazel, Goat. So mind you, a lot of these celebrities, they are pretending to be dumb. Um, Satanism is um, a lot of demonic wisdom in order for you to keep up with, really, um, all of this... Um, all of this freemasonry and you know the rosicrucian order and um gematria all of these things you know actually believe it or not they don't let in people like people into the illuminati that um aren't smart actually so even if these people are pretending to be dumb they're not dumb i guarantee you they they learn a lot about um, demonic spiritualism and it's a lot of reading, a lot of um, demonic understanding. Um, but it's crazy how the spirit of pride um, kind of masks the revelation of Jesus. So these people in their own wisdom deceive themselves when the wisdom of God is the most important wisdom. Amen. Um, and so this is very prophetic because, and this is how I know the Holy Spirit is speaking to Angela White, because this is a, this is a revelation of renunciation. And um, it says in the book of Isaiah, when you throw out idols out of the temple, you, you speak to those idols and you say, get thee hence. You, you, you renounce yourself from those idols. This is a biblical concept that I know the Holy Spirit is ministering to Angela White's spirit man, a concept that a lot of 
Christians don't understand. So she's renouncing herself. This is good, you guys. This is why I I know she was born again. Like I know, I I know that 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 she was born again. Hallelujah. Um, origin, demonology, occupation, goat-headed demon spirit, power, skills, black magic, spiritual physiology, vast dark powers, immortality, umbrakinesis, possession, reality warping, telekinesis, corruption, te telepathy, mind control, necromancy, intelligence on evil. Heavy on that. That's what I'm talking about. These people are smart, but they're smart about evil things. <laughs> Goals, create and spread chaos, abuse, and torment his victims. Crimes, malefic, conspiracy, spiritual corruption, brainwashing. Type of villain, symbolic, corrupter. And this is her own, these are her own words. I'm telling you, these people are smart. Um, around the same time, White also shut down her OnlyFans account, which reportedly generated over $240 million a year. If that figure is even remotely accurate, White is stepping away from a whole lot of money. In an interview with Revolt, White said, I don't do OnlyFans anymore. I don't do it anymore at all. I'm just changing everything about me. It's a dead end. All that stuff is a dead end. And I know that I'm worth way more than that. Hallelujah. This is the sign of true repentance. You see how she's getting sin out of her life? How the Lord is convicting her of sin? You see, this is true repentance. She's not just saying she, ser you know, she serves Jesus. She's she's renouncing herself from things. She's separating herself. She's she's you know stopping uh, d working for the devil. She's no longer working for the devil. This is how I know that the Holy Spirit is in her. But we need to be praying for her because she's still young in the faith and she needs to receive the anointing. She needs to go where the anointing is flowing. Like that's what we need to be praying for. Amen. White also explained that she wanted to set an example to her 10-year-old son, Caro, and her 6-year-old daughter, Dream, who are getting old enough to understand what she's doing for a living. Yeah, hallelujah. And I, I just love it. You know, no one is too far gone. No one is too far gone. You know, um, I don't care uh, what you've been through, what you've done. Jesus is faithful to redeem you, to give you a whole new life. And when you repent, he doesn't even remember your past sins actually he forgets them so as far as i'm concerned you know angela white has never done only fans <laughs> um so on easter sunday she posted a photo shoot on instagram and um the caption was watch st stand fast in faith be brave and strong first corinthians 16 13 hallelujah so she is quoting the word um this is good news this is good news i don't hey hey i'll take it um, so this is where people are, are having, you know, passing judgment in a couple of areas. Um, so she quotes Mark 16, 16. It says, do not be alarmed. You seek Jesus of Nazareth who was crucified. He is risen. He is not here. See the place where they laid him. Mark 16, 6. And she takes this photo of her, um, you know, in front of a cross. Um, and this photo of her also, you know, um, in prayer. Um, and so this picture of her looking devout was still kind of showcasing her butt in some kind of ways and so people were people were um you know judging her and and this is where we have to have discernment you guys um people are are, are sometimes young in the faith you know convictions come they can they come with time and we have to have discernment as to when a christian has no conviction and when a christian is allowing conviction to work through them and so in this case you know, especially like with like stuff like dressing, like it takes sometimes time for people to get conviction about certain things. So, so, um, for me, I'm not, I'm not counting her out. Some people are counting her out because of this photo and I refuse to do that. Um, so of course people criticized her, um, for her dramatic Easter photo shoot and they were saying that she was being extra and doing it for clout. Honestly, I I think it's very sweet. <laughs> I think it's very sweet. I, I I personally wouldn't wear the dress, um, but I I I can see her heart posture. So you guys you guys got to stop judging people on stuff like this. Honestly, a lot of people that are like sharing their judgment, like they're still like watching porn. <laughs> like I'm like y'all got to stop. Y'all got to get the log out of your own eye, okay? Angela White, formerly known as Black China, and she just became a Christian, you guys. She literally just became a Christian. That's why I'm like, 
you know we gotta have we gotta have grace and allow time to convict people of things um the most intense reaction to white's transformation comes from her own mother ex-model tokyo tony um and tony stated that her daughter was in the illuminati and that she was marked for death um so i will i don't think you guys can hear this um on the recording but um, she said that when the Illuminati, the Illuminati is going to come for Angela because they're going to come and all of that kind of things. And that's what Tokyo Tony said and that she feels like her daughter is marked for death. Um, and so Tokyo Tony and Black China, they both call themselves, they're, they're both Christian. Um, but Tokyo Tony, she has a lot of repentance um, still to do and a lot of yielding to the Holy Spirit that still needs to be done because you know, she's still kind of like cursing and she has unforgiveness and anger in her heart still. Um, and I will say maybe Tokyo Tony is not born again. So, you know, Tokyo Tony's lack of faith is revealing that she might not be born again and that we need to be praying for her. Because when you are with Jesus, even if you sign an oath to the Illuminati, if you are with Jesus, the Holy Spirit is going to protect you. When you declare the name of Jesus Christ, Jesus is not going to let the devil touch you he's not going to let them get you because the devil has to listen to the anointing the devil has to listen to jesus and so a lot of these celebrities they think that there's no way out of these oaths no jesus is the way out of these oaths when when you declare jesus christ uh jesus literally says to the devil you cannot touch my daughter angela white you cannot touch her. You cannot kidnap her. You cannot Illuminati sacrifice her. You cannot Gematria kill her. I'm using her. You are not allowed to touch her. So, um, Tokyo Tony, it's okay. <laughs> Your daughter is going to be okay. And even if she does die, she's going to meet the Lord. So, you know, death is not something to be afraid of at all. Um, and even if you were to be tortured or martyred or something like that, it is all for the glory of God. So even in the worst case scenario, you still win. That's why we have to be praying for Tokyo, Tony. Um, so Tony said, uh, when the Illuminati comes for Angela, because they going to come, there's nothing I can do. I don't ever want to go around my daughter again, not alone, not without two pistols and a pit bull. So there's still a very big spirit of fear in Tokyo, Tony. And we're going to pray that she um, receives the Holy Spirit um, because I, she has a lot of unforgiveness and that bitterness can stop you from receiving the anointing of God. In another post, Tony said, Illuminati have got by China. I'm saying this right now. China, you are done out here. And by the way, China and Tony, they've been estranged for a while. So she don't know what's going through the Angela White's head. Okay. And Angela White. <sighs> Tokyo Tony has not been very kind to Angela White throughout her life. And Tokyo Tony actually used to be a madam, which is actually a female pimp. Um, and she used to uh kind of take advantage of Angela White in a lot of ways um so you know they that's why their relationship is so estranged um and so they're not even having contact right now so I I don't know why she's talking like she knows what's going through Angela's head because she doesn't um so that's why we really need to pray for the situation because I just see you know Tokyo and Angela uh reconciling I'm just gonna keep on having faith for that don't say I didn't tell you to prepare for it. I really am. They gonna tear her down. See, this is speaking word curses over people. Um, they gonna put her on drugs. She don't speak up for herself. She sit in that house like a hermit. I'm just done with it. I swear to God, she would sacrifice me for more. What is she doing at the Grammys? What? You ain't did nothing. Can't complete nothing. Um, following the Easter photo shoot, Tokyo said, I am God's child, not China. China is a PR stunt. Come on word we know better i don't give a f word if she don't ever talk to me in life child i raised her had her taught her she know everything this is faking in jesus's name stop her right now put her on her back i'm not playing with you lord take her name out of the last book of life if she playing with you lord in jesus name we're not gonna do that do y'all really think that that's the holy spirit speaking the holy spirit is not gonna pray for people to be taken out the book of life we don't wish for anyone to perish, um, which is very harsh words. And she called her own daughter a S-L-U-T bucket. We need to be praying for Tokyo. She needs deliverance. 
um that's just the devil that's just the enemy um oh so china said in an interview this is what china said um that's just the devil that's just the enemy and guess what i'm not going for it i'm a really intelligent person if you look at her video she always says china my daughter china she never says my daughter angela so guess what those gifts that she's trying to send this way they're not directed towards me my name is angela my name is not china so direct that somewhere else like y'all see like this woman mm, i love my sister in christ angela white hallelujah so then the author and i love the author of vigilant citizen this is why we need to be praying for this person so they said is angela truly changed or is she faking it in all honesty i have absolutely no idea what truly lies in her heart and it is definitely not my job to judge if one is a proper christian or not however seeing her take the exact opposite i usually describe on this site has been refreshing and i welcome more of this in mass media no matter what her true intentions are, the actions she has taken in the past months are objectively healthy and positive, so I don't see why anyone would be mad at any of this. I used to strongly dislike Black China and everything she stood for. I didn't know much about her and I wanted it to stay that way. There was this dark energy surrounding her that just urged me to look away. Maybe it was because she gyrated around the Kardashian witch coven for years. Maybe it was because her own mother appears to be rather toxic. In any case, the new, fresh-faced Angela White doesn't seem to have this dark energy surrounding her anymore. Maybe she's truly changed, and maybe she truly turned her back on the industry, and that is why her mother is saying that the Illuminati marked her for death. Then again, maybe Angela White is fooling us. One thing is for sure, she won't be fooling God. Hallelujah. So, I am just so blessed by Angela White's testimony, and... I can see her testimony even softening the heart of the of the person who writes the Vigilant Citizen articles. Like, I am so blessed by this. You guys don't even know. I want so many more celebrities to see the light of Christ. And so many are, you know, but uh, not by China. Angela White is truly born again. She even has spiritual discernment. You guys see she she clocked it so quick that her that the enemy is using her own mother. And that is so that is the wisdom of God right there. And that is so, so, so powerful for her to be walking in faith like this, proclaiming the name of Jesus, even though she used to be, you know, in the Freemason cults. That is so powerful, and I know that this testimony is going to be powerful even to other celebrities who are afraid of proclaiming the name of Jesus. So, um, so yeah, I'm just so, so thankful for what the Lord is doing, and let's just thank the Lord for our sister Angela, and let's just pray that she continues to go from glory to glory in the name of Jesus, and that she receives the baptism of the Holy Spirit, that she encounters the anointing of God, and that the Lord continues to use her, and that she is kept in the hands of God no matter matter what in jesus mighty name um so i pray this blessed you if you if you want uh if this if you want to share any of your thoughts please comment down below and if you liked this then please uh subscribe uh we preach the gospel here on this channel and we expose how jesus defeats the devil every single time um when we like share these uh conspiracy theory and you know hollywood videos and stuff like that so god bless you so 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 much and bye